One of my favorite memories of my dad was when he would build us snow castles in the winter. They were elaborate with turrets and towers and slides, and we would play on them for hours. My dad was always a very innovative person. He could build anything, he could make anything. He would just engage wholeheartedly in having fun. He did so much for other people. He worked hard, but he always had time to do things, to make things, to be creative, to travel, to take us to new places. We did a lot of amazing things with my dad. My name is Carol. My dad's name is Aaron. And he has cerebral amyloid angiopathy, which is a form of vascular disruption that causes dementia. When I saw my dad starting to struggle with memory, it was alarming. You have a person who has this depth of knowledge that seems to be slipping from his grasp. It was frightening for him. I became aware of Dr. Zara Musavi's cognitive program through a friend. It looked a little daunting, but he was game to try it. And he was eligible for the program, and he's been part of her study for more than two years now. The way he's improved is really astonishing. He goes from being completely vague and almost nonverbal to being talkative, like his old self. He remembers family members' names. He's feeling more capable of making decisions. And interesting, after being in the therapy, he started walking better with improved balance. I really feel like my dad has had a second chance. It sounds trite, but there's a new lease on life. I'm certain that without this treatment, my dad's quality of life would be very different, that he wouldn't be able to participate in all the different things we've done over the years. love Zara. They just have a special relationship. My dad has just flourished under her care. There are so many exciting things happening in Manitoba because of engineers and the work they do to help improve the lives and safety of Manitobans. What I really hope when people hear my dad's story is that they realize that there are many things that can be done, that research is of incredible value, that there is hope for the future. <laughs> <laughs>